All right, the video you're about to watch here is a video we did for a BC government grant submission. So we were applying for the BC Fast Pilot Grant. They needed us to make a video. This is the video we applied to them. Well guys, we're here today at MCON Services, here to tell you about this exciting project we're working on together, the world's first electric hybrid snowplow. Here we go. So you don't know who MCON Services is, they operate a very extensive area within British Columbia. They got a contract in the Kootenays and on the islands, in the Caribou, and even in the Rockies. Meaning that our snowplow, once it's commissioned for them, will operate throughout various conditions in the province of British Columbia. And uh, it's been an incredible partnership with them thus far. Now to build the world's first electric snowplow, you need some heavy spec electric axles. We're super proud of what we designed and developed here at Edison. What you see here in front of us is one of the higher spec in terms of power and weight category uh, for an electric vehicle of this size. And it's already here ready to go into this particular project. So you just saw the axles inside, but what's below me here are the frame rails for this actual project. Just showcasing, we got the partners, the parts are starting to come in and looking forward to slapping this thing together. So to operate a snowplow, you need hydraulics. You know, this big tank here holds all this fluid, which does so many different things on the vehicle. Now in a traditional ice vehicle, that is actually that pump is hooked up directly to the engine and it saps a tremendous amount of power. Now on our electric vehicle, we have to manage that pump using an electric motor, but that's when it comes in. We actually might be able to see a 30% fuel savings just from that alone. Now to ensure project success, we're working with MCON in their own factory here in Merritt, BC. This means that we'll have great mentorship along the way, great resources, and all their expertise, because they do this stuff every day. So what makes this a different vehicle than most traditional electrics is that it's a hybrid. So what you see behind me here is an actual generator. Pretty cool, right? So what we do is we pack our own level three fast charger. It's completely diesel powered, but you're getting power directly to the batteries and your drivetrain. What this does, it reduces range anxiety entirely. So we have a few milestones associated with this project. We projected a 30% fuel efficiency gain per vehicle. We've also projected 20 tons of CO2 reduction per vehicle. We're really hoping to be able to validate this through trials and pilot testing this winter. Also, we really want to get operator data and operator feedback. This is so crucial and why the MCOM partnership is awesome. So I'm Frank Rosardo. I'm president of MCOM Services. We're uh, the largest highway maintenance company in Canada. We operate out of uh, BC, Alberta and Ontario. We've been operating a highway maintenance since uh, 1988. At MCOM, uh, we support Edison's goal of using technology to achieve not only improvements in environmental uh, guidelines that are set by government, but also the use of new technology in achieving those guidelines. We believe that investments in the technology and the application that it will provide for our company is positive and that, that's why we invested. We believe that the milestones that are set by the project are positive and achieve both our private sector goals as well as government set goals. That's why we've invested in the first plow truck and anticipate that there'll be many more to follow. We're so happy that MCON Services is our first customer. I mean, they already paid towards the engineering, development, and purchased the parts that you saw here today with me. Um, and we just thank you so much for all your support as we get this project going. All right, so we submitted that video and shocking to us, we actually received our very first government grant. The IRAP BC Fast Program, uh, Fast Pilot Program was approved for $200,000 for us to do this hybrid snowplow project. So I want to thank Gary Jean at IRAP and everyone who was involved in this. So it's really, really cool. Make sure if you want to see this hybrid snowplow get built, you follow along with the channel. We got frame rails that are being laid in the MCON shop right now. They're at the same stage of this currently. 
And it's just kind of cool. We won our first ever government grant. <laughs>